Good morning guys, I hope you're all doing well. So today's vlog is going to be a one dayer because Sam and I are heading off to the Warner Brothers Harry Potter Studios today and I am so excited, I've never been before. We booked this back in March when Gringotts first opened and this is literally the earliest time that we could get a ticket and it's current, well, it's not even morning, I said good morning, it's actually like three o'clock now. No, two o'clock and we're about to head off and our time is at five. Um, but it was the earliest we could get in apart from like seven, eight o'clock at night. So we thought this was like the best time to go. Um, wearing the outfit, I'm gonna show you in a minute and very excited. Did actually pay for these ourselves, these are not gifted or anything. Something I've wanted to do for literally years and I'm so excited to be finally going. <laughs> So today's outfit is this, I've just got this little dress on from Revolve which is blue because Ravenclaw, very important part of today. And then this little denim jacket is from Next, so just wearing a little cropped one because I thought it's not too hot and it's not too cold, so this is just like a nice little layer. Um, I've got my little Supergas on which are like the rope detail ones and my little Marc Jacobs bag that is my new baby. But yeah, this is my outfit for Harry Potter World and I'm very excited. So, we've just got here, it took us about an hour and a half, no, it took us about two hours, didn't it really, to get here, an hour, hour and a half, half. Um, not too bad, obviously from London, but it is a drive still, um, we're about to go in, we're about an hour early, so we're going to sit and have a little Starbucks just inside before we go around for our little tour, and we're hoping they'll let us in like just a little bit early, so that we're not like waiting around for too long, but we'll see, you excited? Okay. <laughs> Sam's had a seven minute power nap in the car. Honestly, those seven, seven minutes, minutes made such a difference. <laughs> he literally had seven minutes, woke up and was like singing Miranda, like. I fully recharged, also I look quite tired. That's because you are really tired. Mm. You are so brown and I am so pale. Not what they say. <laughs> <laughs> um, I do want to go get a coffee now. Let's go get coffee. See you in five.
it's the Hogwarts Express. Ah! It's literally the coolest thing ever. Like, I feel like a child again, just running around and reliving all my little Harry Potter dreams. So, so cool. Like, it's literally insane. I'm obsessed. Um, but I think we're going to go here and now and just go into the Hogwarts Express. But I think we definitely call it at the right time because there's not that many kids. Because obviously, a lot of schools are still in school. Um, so it's not as busy as it could be, but I'm very excited to keep looking around. I think we're only like not even halfway yet, so that's really cool. How are you enjoying your million time here? It's my fourth time and I'm a red one. I graduated one more, so it's really <laughs> Sounds good. Sounds basically a tour guide. Do you say you graduated one more? Yes. Are you enjoying the fourth time in a Yes, I'm not really enjoying it. <laughs> You're really trying to be fair. Yeah, exactly. We're in bright white and... And your talk time like... Are you enjoying it? I'm loving it. Good. It's really fun. Awkward. Just catching up on emails while you wait for the train. I've got to get my Aperol in. Your Aperol? Yeah. <laughs> The original Privet Drive house is actually down the road from where I grew up. So when we were younger, we actually saw them all like filming and they used to park in the Tesco's car park and then like keep all the tour buses and stuff there. Not tour buses, um, like changing room buses and stuff. So we literally watched them film like different parts and I think that's really cool. So I always laugh because this is literally next to my local Tesco's back, Tesco's, <laughs> Tesco's back home. <laughs> Creature animation and like creation room. <clears throat> so it's all 
like the heads and all the cool little bits so really really cool in here like this is the bit I'm fascinated by is how they created all the figures and like prosthetics and stuff it's just so cool This is like a little model design, so it's like all miniatures of how everything would have looked. And then through here is inside Gringotts. Oh my god! Wait. Wow, look at that. That is incredible. you would imagine it and it's just like you're literally walking around it obviously is a set but it's so cool um and all the little shops and stuff really really sweet <laughs> crazy that this is the Hogwarts castle and they film like all of the exterior shots on this and then obviously green screen it all together but the detail on this is unbelievable like it's just I think the people who made Harry Potter are literally like absolute geniuses because the skill it takes to do some of the stuff they've done is mental There's so much. Sam's on the hunt for his Bertie bots. <laughs> Have you? I think I'm gonna get a chocolate frog. Let's get like a good box that's not battered. A host of goodies. Sam's got his Bertie bots ready to have in the car. You've picked one with nice ones. Well, you can't tell. Hoping that I've got enough of the nice ones, and then I'll be great. Hopefully. And then I've got a chocolate frog and a ceramic frog. We've just got home from Harry Potter Studios and I have to admit it was really really good. So I've never been, I don't really know how, but I really enjoyed it. I think we paid about £40 each per ticket and the Gringotts Bank is amazing. Definitely worth going if you haven't seen that yet. Um, and the Forbidden Forest is really really cool too, which Sam hadn't seen yet and he went about two years ago did you say? When's the last time you went? I remember like two or three years ago. Is that the last time you went? Mm -hmm. And you didn't see the Forbidden Forest? No yeah, it wasn't there then. So, if you haven't been in that long, they're definitely worth a visit. But Sam bought some Bertie bots and said we have to try them, so we're going to give them a go now. Okay, so we have to, we've made like a makeshift tripod, so this might be a bit of a weird angle, but let's go. Um, you're going first. Don't look. Close your eyes. No, because you're going to look. No, 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 look. Close your eyes. Oh no. Close Can we get eyes. water then, please? No, just close your eyes. The only thing I want to save me is garlic bread. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. It's strong. Close your eyes. Don't look. I can see you looking. <laughs> No, don't you dare, because you'll make me I'm pick a bad typo, is it? I'm covering it. 
Just one. Put it in the right looking. I don't know what that is, but it's not bad. It's yellow, bright yellow. It's like lemon. It must be the lemon shirt. Mm -hmm. It must be like a dog pill. Yours has potential to be really good because it's one of three. Mmm. Dookie -dook -dook -dook. like So it's cinnamon or cherry? Cherry. Or earthworm. Oh, so nice. Okay, one more. I'm going to be a few. I don't know what that one is. The cinnamon. No. <laughs> <laughs> I press it. No, you gotta eat it. Don't taste like mud. That might be the earthworm one. Oh, my mouth tastes like dirt. Right, I'm gonna go for that one. <laughs> I was like, it might be soap. I think it was dirt. No, it's not the dirt one. It was brown. So it's either dirt or sausage or vomit. It's not the vomit. Not the vomit. It was like really dark. That's really nice. It was one of these. That was really nice, whatever one that was. Oh, right. I just had an earth one. <laughs> no, I have one of these ones. We're both going to do the same. What are we going to do? Stop like looking. It's <laughs> Okay, go. Right, we'll do that one. Where's it gone? <laughs> so where's it gone? <laughs> Where did it go? <laughs> oh, it's not. <laughs> where's it gone? Mm. No. You've got to do it. it. No. It fell. Penalty. It fell. Oh no, it's a bogey. No, it's not. There's one of three. This can be. Go. I don't want it. Earwax. That started really nice. <laughs> He's a disgusting. Why do people do this? Oh, oh, please get, please get water up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's the black pepper. Please give me a nice one after that. No, I was going to give you a, a rotten ink. I've just picked some out because rather than like going through them all, I wanted to try some nice and some horrible ones. I'm not going to tell you what one this is. Yeah, but it's not fair that you know and I don't. But I'm still eating it. I think the more before, I've tried really every is. single one before. Come on. Look at our little pile of chewed on. <laughs> Come on, try it. This is gross, isn't it? It's a nasty one, but not nasty. What is that? Soap. Mm -mm. That tastes like palm of violet. I like that. Mmm, soapy. Mm, okay, it's burning. I know that's a good one, so keep that till last. No. There's two goods here. Eat that one. Well, it definitely isn't vomit. It still just tastes like soap. Blueberry. <laughs> it tastes like soap. Does it actually? Yeah. It's good. I can still taste soap. Right, this is possibly the worst one in the whole thing. It's vomit flavour. I'm. She's got to try it though. Like, I'm gonna do it as well. Come on. Oh, Sam. Come on, do it for the vine. <laughs> I know you're not even eating it. <laughs> No, oh, just you're, eat no, because you're nearly vomiting trying it. Just eat it. Come on. No, I'm going to be sick. You just, make, you just made me eat it. I just have feet. <laughs> I just have feet. It's in my teeth, isn't it? It's not vomit. It's like, that should be like sweaty socks. No, thank you. Not... Right. Last one. The after flavour, once you've got rid of the vomit, is like. Not that bad. No, right, this What's is banana. This? No, it's not. Yeah, actually, it's banana. That's really nice. I want to try Tutti Frutti. Okay. That one. Who would pay however much to put themselves through this? Us. Oh, us. <laughs> <laughs> and then, yeah, marshmallow is my favourite, is that one. Mm. That one you like. What's that? Oh, black pepper. Mm. The one that you avoided. <laughs> In fairness, I didn't avoid it. I literally couldn't find it. So I'm going to end the video there. I don't know how successful or boring or not that ended up being. But I mean, yeah. All in the edit. All in the edit. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video.